I love to go to work. I just do. We, uh, I think in the masonry industry, everybody gets up early. And we hit the job site at daylight. We try and beat the sun. I've always been an early morning person. I really never thought of 4.30 or 5.30 as being early. Other people do, it's just been something I always do. Oh golly, I, I think one of the reasons we moved here was because we saw the growth potential of Phoenix, Arizona. It's Arizona. Everybody wants to move out west. Well, we were living in the Valley of the Sun and every radio station talked about the Valley of the Sun. So we became Sun Valley Masonry. I, in bidding our work, there was always something out there to, uh, to bid, to go after. Uh, eventually our company got to the size where we were saturating the market and couldn't find enough work to bid for the people we had working, which is the reason we started into concrete and uh, opening up our office in Stillwater, Oklahoma. My partner and I have to lead by example. And we've done that. We've led good Christian lives. Uh, we respect our employees. Uh, we give them the lead and let them grow and let them make decisions. And uh, when we disagree with that, uh, we'll make every effort we can to point them in the right direction. The best times had to be uh, probably after 1992, up until the year, probably about 2004. Uh, I've always been told that Arizona runs in three-year cycles. Uh, we'd have two good years and then one, one bad year and that would recover and we'd have two more good years. But that one lasted, it must have been 20 years and we never had any problem finding work, uh, never had any problem finding profitable projects. One of the fondest memories I have was when we built and secured the Regatta Project, which had a lot of very technical and difficult work in it for a mason. At that time, it was the largest project we ever had. It drew a lot of attention to us, if there's a 12-month schedule on a project, we'll be honest with them and tell us 12 months. Our objective may be to do it in nine or 10 months, but we will not, absolutely will not overcommit. I think my largest personal challenge has been my accident. I've had two spinal cord injuries. After I was able to recover from that, it becomes difficult to just sit down and build work when you're used to being out uh, building it yourself. But my partner does a much better job than I do. I think of any college graduate that wants to be in the construction industry, if I were to give them any advice, it first of all to be honest, especially with all your employees. Uh, work hard and love what you do. And uh, if you love what you do, you'll never have a hard day at work.